Hello YouTube, my name is Amulya and you are watching Tube Mint. In this video, I'm going to show you how to dynamically list images using PHP. And at the same time, I'll, I will also show you how to display images dynamically. So if you have more than like 100 images, 1000 images and you do not want to do everything manually, you can display them dynamically at the same time i'm i'm also going to show you i'll tell you how you can convert from jpeg to png to jpeg or jpg whatever format you need so let's go ahead and get started okay so you can see i've got this simple directory with few images in two formats jpg and png you can see it here all right so if I just want to list in JPEG, you can see these are the JPG, sorry, not JPEG, JPG file format. If I want to just uh, see the PHP, I've got one PHP and PNG. So these are PNG files. All right, so let's get started. Let's have a look at the code so you can understand how it's working. You can see it's very simple. So I'm going to use for each loop and then few inbuilt PHP methods that make this job very easy so you can see if i just go ahead and comment these so these are basically image tags so i'm going to say for each and i'm going to use globe php method that is already inbuilt so I simply have to look for you can see what it does. So, find path names matching in a pattern, okay? So the, these are few arguments that you can give and few examples right here. So we are going to use this for each loop to list all the files ending with this extension as this variable. So this is what we are trying to do here. So for each globe, anything that ends with PNG, this is meant every, all the files. I'm not going to give like name of each files. You can do that too, by the way. And then each file name is going to be stored in this variable. And this is what I'm trying to do. I'm going to echo the file name in the PHP. So if I just refresh it, you can see it's just echoing the file name. If I have to display it, I'm going to use this image tag, HTML image tag, and put this file name in the SRC. And same goes to the alt attribute. And just if I just uh, save it and refresh it, you can see it starts displaying the images. Similarly goes with the JPG format. So I'll go ahead and uncomment it and this starts displaying the images. So you can do a lot of things with just these two lines of codes and the other thing a lot of people do with this simple PHP script, they convert images from like PNG to jpg or jpeg to reduce or compress the file size so that it can load faster on the internet and for that you can use inbuilt methods like these so this is going to only work on png so similar functions are available on this php uh, website you can see it here if i go to this method uh, you can see these are the image methods that you can use uh, for your requirements. So go ahead and look up for this. So this is only going to create a file name of the image that ends with PNG. And then, okay, here you see, and I'm going to use image JPEG. So basically it's going to convert PNG to JPEG file name file name and this is going to be the compression i can give it 60 so this is the quality of the image that you look looking for and save it and it's going to 
converted so this will go under here okay because it's just the png image so this is how you can convert from one format to other i have already done it and it works so i'm not going to do it again but this is working so that's all for this video guys if you have any questions suggestions, leave in the comment below i will try to answer it asap thank you bye for now